All right, I'm gonna do this quick, like fast, like in a minute. If you guys want to have like a really bright map, all right, all you gotta do is just you know go into D Inspire, do a search for blue map, and then get go into the Git and make it false. So just do this, return as a false, and then that's it. Compile that, and then uh, just install it, put it in game, and you're good. Alright, back in game. If I go over there, you'll see that bingo bango is gonna be a bright map. There we go, it's got a soft glow on everything. Yeah, I don't know. I thought it was pretty cool. I was messing around and I found it. And I was like, oh, this is kinda cool. Because most games in Unit D3D, they, they have a boom setting and uh, it's usually disabled by default on most games because it's kind of intensive, because it's uh, post processing. And you can turn it on. So I was playing around with my other games, and they they all had bloom effects too. And I turned them on, and some of them had settings where I could turn them way up. And man, it looks kind of cool. But yeah, anyway, enjoy. <laughs>